Okay, people, I am back in with the debut of my water deck, which is which is now known as um, which I'm gonna call it. I'm gonna call it. Uh, I'm gonna call this deck Aquatic Illusion. Aquatic Illusion. Mm-hmm. Here's the first cards. The chain healing card from my Dino deck is now in this one. This needed a life points card really badly. Dust Tornado, Spellbinding Circle, Mele uh, Melevant Catastrophe, Damage Vaccine Omega Max, Shield Spear, Tornado Wall, Poseidon Wave, Isbayan, Widespread Ruin. Aqua Jet, More of Greed, Lucky Iron X, Fisher, Legendary Ocean, Heavy Storm, uh, Unsteel Evolution, M MST, Double Cyclone, Thunder Short. Now for the monsters. The first water monster is Kaldaris, and I'm going to explain his effect. You can send, you can send one face, uh, you can send one face, uh, boomy card, uh, you control to the graveyard to select up the two cards your opponent controls, and you can send them to the graveyard. Very good effect. Well called for. Shark Cruiser, that's the help of water types, so is this. Got two Shark Cruisers, got one... Got two Droop Frogs for Xyz summoning Kaji Gachi Gachi Gendetsu. Maho, uh, you recognize this deck if you if you from my original Red Eyes build a year ago. He's back, my armed Sea Hunter. He he he! Welcome back, old friend. Now for the first time, here's two new Yu-Gi-Oh monsters: the Spearfish Soldiers. For each water, for each sea. For each water monster that is removed from play, whether fish, sea serpent, or aqua type, he will. This monster will gain 100 attack. Next up, my Tangio, a very old Yu-Gi-Oh card, but well called for. Spine Gilman, just like Legendary Ocean, this guy is basically a field spell card, and he's a very good attacker. Drill Barnacle, very nice. And he's pretty much an attack directly card. My two, well, I got one fire. I got here one fire of Fly Fang, and I'm guessing you guys know what this monster is. It's a Sky Star Ray. Thank you, Yu-Gi-Oh podcast for mm, telling me about this card. Kogimoru Sea Panther. Cannon, cannonball through the spear, spear shellfish. My high tycoon chin. Hmm. Creeping doomed mana. My second fly thing. My penguin soldier. One, and I got two nightmare penguins. Kaiser seahorse. Silent abyss. Gachi gachi kintetsu. Very good Xyz monster. Mm, and those uh, droop frogs are very good, uh, very good uh, sacrifices for. Gotcha, gotcha. Aqua Spirit, very old Yu-Gi-Oh card, but this one's gonna be useful. And the uh, and uh, the star and the star of the show, Air Orca. Very good monster. Because as I banish all types of fish, sea serpent, aqua types, I get to destroy my opponent's cards. Very nice. Well called for. Well, I'm hoping you enjoyed my double feature tonight. Expect Dragon's Devastation's final update for the time being to be revealed right now. Why don't we take a look at it since I got time? Alright, Dragon's Devastation 4.0. This is it.
All right, Dragon's Devastation. I got it right here. All right, Dragon's Devastation build 4.0. Um, not a lot of things have changed. I've, I've made a few adjustments to the monsters. The token and Destiny Hero engines are gone. So is my Junk Synchron. Because my Drill Warrior is fully taking over. Here's what we got here. Arm Dragon level 5. Red Eyes Darkness Metal Dragon. Tulian Rage. Synchro Boost. Twin Sword Marauder. X Saber Galahad. I've got one Red Eyes Wyvern. Archfiend Interceptor. My legendary Red Eyes Black Dragon. Mirage Dragon. My second Wyvern. Dash Warrior. Stamming Destruction. Warrior Returning Alive. Tribute to the Doomed. Shadow Delver. Call of the Haunted. Number one and two. <laughs> okay, we also got Bottomless 1, Bottomless 2, Regeki Break 1, Reflect Bounder, Chaos Burst, Regeki Break 2, Reinforcement of the Army, Mass Dragon, Yamada Dragon, after a year of absence, is back in action in place of my blue eyes. Jester Lord is finally back in action after a, for the first time ever. This is the first time I'll be using this card. Very nice card. If you destroy your opponent's monster, you can really ensure yourself some damage with this. And since he's a dark type, he'll be good for Shadow Delver's effect. All you gotta do is lay some good spell and trap cards down and you are good to go. Sasuke Samurai. Ninja Grandmaster. Duskawala. Mirror Force. Magma Drago. Junk Drill Synchron. My Fairy of the Spring and Dust Tornado. Dust Tornado number two. Fairy of the Spring number two. Premature Burial. Pitch Black Werewolf, Cold Enchanter, Cyber Gymnast, Field Commander Ruse, Black Pendant, Zoga, Healing Wave Generator, Levile Magma Cannoneer, Kaiko the Ghost Destroyer, and X Saber Airbellum are back in action. And the last card, Evil Hero Malicious Edge. Now for my extra deck. Okay, I have this all separated into three cards. First one up is my Hundred Eyes Dragon. Combining this with my um, Twin Sword Marauder's effect. Oh, you can cause some damage in a hurry. So that's a good monster. Next up, my Drill Warrior. Very good for discarding. And last but not least, Zeman Ape King. These two are my star players in my deck. This is part of my discard engine. Well, I'm hoping you guys l enjoyed this little feature. Um, I showed off. Um, uh, 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 I showed off a few updates. New decks have been built. My next update will be right when I get my next pack of cards, everybody, and that'll be next month. And I plan to get three variety pack cards. So keep a lookout for that. And in the news today, um, well, um, I've been hearing some things about a new, new Yu-Gi-Oh! pack coming out. Um, I've been hearing things about, about, um, a galactic overload. Um, I don't know if this is an actual pack or not. If it is, please let me know if this is true. Um, well, I'm really almost out of time, um, uh, this is MLB11X NC22 saying goodbye, see you later, adios amigos.